Tracker Team Forecast with Chief Meteorologist Sam Parrish. Welcome back, friends. Well, we have some scattered showers and thunderstorms moving across the metro area over the last couple of hours, putting down quite a bit of heavy rainfall in a short period of time. As a matter of fact, we had a flood advisory in effect for just a little bit. Now looking at our tower cam off to the north and west, you can see some thunderstorms off in the distance, putting down some heavy rainfall, and we have a severe thunderstorm warning, and I'll show you that on radar in just a moment. But look at the temperature. It's down to 79 degrees at the airport, 74 on the dew point, so we have a little bit of a heat index, but not too bad at 82 and the pressure is at 30 inches even right now. Let's take a look at the storm that does have the severe thunderstorm warning in effect until 6 o'clock. That does include Ibervale Parish, and it's mainly for this storm right now over the Plaquemine area, extending down towards Indian Village and the parks, and then a little bit further to the south, just to the north and west of Choctaw, putting down quite a bit of lightning with that storm and also possibility of some small hail and some gusty winds. Other thunderstorms around Donaldsonville, down towards Clottsville, and then further to the south to the around Freetown and Bellwood, and and then we have other thunder showers up to the north in western Pike County in southwestern Mississippi and also in west western portions of East Feliciana Parish around Wilson right now. And we're going to see these scattered showers and storms as we go through the weekend, but lesser and lesser of a chance in the weekend. Right now we're looking at temperatures ranging from 79 here in the city, but check out Macomb. They're still at 90, 92 in Woodville with no precipitation there. So where it does rain, at least the temperatures drop down into the 70s, making it feel a little bit more comfortable because look at the heat index right now in Woodville. Feels like 102, 89 in Denton Springs and 99 in Hammond. Now tomorrow we're going to see the heat index values again over 100 and then maybe around 107 here in the city, 109 in Hammond. So don't be surprised if heat advisories are in effect again for tomorrow. High pressure is going to be in control all the way through the weekend, and that means the heat is just going to continue to build, and also the rain chances are going to start to go down just a little bit as we go into the latter part of the weekend. In fact, looking at the forecast for tonight, we're going to see those scattered showers and storms, and then tomorrow, scattered showers and storms, and then on Sunday, I think the rain chances start to decrease a little bit. Lows tonight in the 70s, and then highs tomorrow in the 90s with scattered thunderstorms around. Over the next seven days, we're going to be looking at rain chances dwindling as we go into Saturday, especially in the afternoon with highs in the mid 90s. And then in the early part of next week, it gets into the upper 90s, approaching 100 by the time we get into Wednesday. Stay